Hello warriors, I am Dr. Akerkar and welcome to this episode of Stand for AS videos. Today we would be discussing about fibromyalgia. Fibromyalgia has found mention in many of our videos. It is a chronic ailment that causes pain all over the body, sleep disturbances, fatigue and often emotional and mental distress. It causes widespread pain and this pain resembles arthritis but fibromyalgia affects the soft tissue and not the joints unlike arthritis. What are the symptoms of fibromyalgia? Pain and stiffness all over the body, fatigue of fibromyalgia, this fatigue can be really debilitating. All of us have experienced fatigue. We generally experience fatigue after a long day, exertion. This type of fatigue generally improves after a good sleep, rest or a cup of coffee. Fatigue of fibromyalgia is quite severe and may not improve even with 7-8 to eight hours sleep, rest or a cup of coffee. It is debilitating and one may not be able to even manage day-to-day -day activities due to the fatigue. Sleep disturbances of fibromyalgia, they can be quite disturbing. One may find it difficult to fall asleep due to the pain. Once asleep, fibromyalgia may lead to repeated awakening. Many a times it is non-restorative sleep, even 6 to 7 hours of sleep is not refreshing and one feels that more sleep is needed. Problems with thinking, memory and concentration are common with fibromyalgia. One can have brain fog. One may feel confused or disorganized or find it hard to focus or put thoughts into words. Think about these scenarios. You are in a meeting discussing some important stuff and you can't recollect why the meeting was called. Worse still, you cannot recollect what you said 5 minutes before. Think about this situation. What if this happens repeatedly? You go to the train station and you just can't remember where you want to go and why you are going there. This is exactly what brain fog is. What if such things start happening repeatedly? This is the brain fog of fibromyalgia. Headaches including migraines are common. One can also have abdominal pain, constipation, bladder disturbances, painful menses, tingling numbness in the hands and feet, sensitivity to cold or heat, sound stiffness in the joints and muscles particularly in the morning, dizziness, burning sensation in multiple locations in the body. These are the various things that can happen with fibromyalgia. Pain can have different characters. It could be stabbing, burning, piercing, deep-seated, dull ache, throbbing. Unlike arthritis, fibromyalgia does not cause any visible redness, swelling of the joints. One may have swelling, but this is diffuse and not really restricted to a particular joint. The whole foot, whole hand would be swollen. So many times the person feels that there is swelling, but this is perceived swelling. Since it is perceived, the person who has pain feels that there is swelling, but others will not be able to see or appreciate that swelling because as I said, it is perceived swelling and this happens because of the deep-seated pain. Most of the symptoms of fibromyalgia have no visible component and others are not able to appreciate and recognize them. Nobody can make out what is exactly going on. By the looks of it, the person suffering from fibromyalgia looks hale and hearty. Often the symptoms are invisible and then people start feeling that this is all in the head. That is what happens most of the times with fibromyalgia. What causes fibromyalgia? Genetics. Fibromyalgia tends to run in families but we still don't know the exact gene causing it. Infections, they can trigger fibromyalgia. And lastly, a stressful, traumatic, physical or emotional event such as a car accident is definitely known to cause fibromyalgia. What is the cause of widespread pain in fibromyalgia? Fibromyalgia is currently understood to be a disorder of central pain processing or a disorder of central sensitivity. The pain threshold is altered such that routine stimuli that should not cause pain do become painful, a simple pat on the back, a slightly loud sound, breeze of the air, 
ब्रीज ऑफ एयर कंडीशनर और सीलिंग फैन कैन ऑल बिकम पेनफुल और इनटॉलरेबल दिस इज ड्यू टू द फॉल्टी पेन प्रोसेसिंग वन कैन ऑल्सो हैव पेन विदाउट एनी स्पेसिफिक रीजन हाउ डू वी रियली डायग्नोज फाइब्रोमाइलजिया देर इज नो डायग्नोस्टिक टेस्ट फॉर फाइब्रोमाइलजिया एज देर इज नो स्ट्रक्चरल एबनॉमिलिटी एक्सरेज एम आर आई सी टी स्कैन अल्ट्रासाउंड ऑल द स्कैन आर जनरली नॉर्मल अनलाइक आर्थराइटिस देर इज नो इन्फ्लमेशन और स्वेलिंग इन द जॉइंट्स बिकॉज ऑफ फाइब्रोमाइलजिया सो नो इन्फ्लमेशन इज विजिबल एक्सटर्नली और ऑन द एम आर आई वन सफरिंग फ्रॉम फाइब्रोमाइलजिया इनफैक्ट कीप्स वॉन्ड्रिंग एज टू वाई ऑल द रिपोर्ट्स आर रिपीटेडली नॉर्मल डिस्पाइट द पेन दैट वन एक्सपीरियंसिस इट इज अ डायग्नोसिस ऑफ एक्सक्लूजन we test for all other causes of widespread pain like arthritis vitamin deficiencies thyroid neurological issues and then come to a conclusion that this is fibromyalgia after ruling out all other causes of widespread pain do we have treatment for fibromyalgia definitely yes there are quite a few modalities not just medicines but other modalities as well to take care of fibromyalgia fibromyalgia can also coexist with other types of arthritis like rheumatoid arthritis ankylosing spondylitis we would be having a look at more details of fibromyalgia and also the treatment of fibromyalgia in our upcoming session do join us again next week for the same till then keep smiling thank you very much